Most, if not all of us, believe in Jesus. And most of us, if I were to ask you one-on-one or maybe in a small group setting, if you believe that Jesus was resurrected from the grave, you would say, yeah, I believe that, Pastor. Sure, that's part of the gospel. I believe that. And if that's true of you, praise God. However, because this work was done on your behalf so long ago, it may not have the same sting, the same, the same zeal, the same impact on your life currently as it once did. If that's the case, then this final section is meant to help you because never should the, the work that Jesus Christ has done on our part, our behalf, become dull and passe, but rather it should remain fresh in our minds and our hearts. I pray that these truths plus others would permeate your heart causing you to have a deeper appreciation for Jesus and a renewed appreciation for what he alone has done. Loved ones, we have done a tremendous amount of work in the book of Mark. And you've heard a lot about the resurrection, a lot about chapter 16 of Mark. As Michael gets ready to lead us in worship again, how about we do this? Take a moment or so and contemplate something you heard, you experienced, or something you read for yourself. And then Michael is going to lead us back into a time of worship. I think the only thing that we should do upon hearing a sermon like this and thinking about the book of Mark as a whole is to fall on our knees and worship Jesus afresh.